kidding me? Oh my God, this is so fun being here. I love it. I, I have known you now, what is it, like 25 years? Yes. I'm so bad with math, but it's it's so long. So long, Drew. Is it 25 years? I mean, it might, yeah, 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 at least. Yeah, yeah. It might be longer. Yeah, that's wild. Um, this book made me feel like I was meeting you for the first time. Oh, thank you, Drew. It really did. It's thank so you. incredible. Thank you. And the book opens and you're talking about your childhood and everything is peaceful and normal and you're in a big family, a mom, a dad, two sisters. Yes. And then um, in 1969, your family was coming home from a party. Um, it's a long drive home. Um, people are tired. There's debates whether to take the car ride or not. Mm -hmm and it um, matriculates into a car accident, mm -hmm. and that crash killed your mom mm -hmm. and your baby sister and cousin, and mm -hmm. you were in the car. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How was it writing about this? Yeah, and I was gonna say, so in that accident too, my dad did survive. He was very badly injured. His legs were badly injured, and my um, so yeah, so my baby sister was killed, but my older sister, Mary, survived too. So there were three deaths, three, three survivors. My life changed in a split second. The rug was pulled from under me. Life as I knew it changed in one second. And it was, it was, it was, you know, uh, it was, it was really hard, you know? So writing that chapter, once I was done with that chapter, I was like, okay, I can take a deep breath. Now we can get on with the story. But I kind of, I could, I could not not include it because it, losing my mom at an early age had a profound effect on my life. And, um, and then my dad went on to, you know, he, he was devastated of course too. And then he went on to raise two girls. He tried his hardest. I really admired him. And you know, that was not so easy. He had braces on his legs from the accident had to learn to walk again and um he really gave it his, gave it his all you know it was like skiing down you know the black diamond uh ski slope with no poles not the easiest you know yes yeah yeah absolutely and you're one of the most emboldened brave fearless people mm -hmm. and so it's so humanizing because yeah. i would imagine and maybe i'm assuming wrong but even me, who's bold, yeah. like watches you do Mary Catherine Gallagher and Sally <laughs> O'Malley and all your characters and think, God, the spine on that woman. <laughs> That's so funny. Aww. Thank you. I mean, there's a picture of you. I think it's the first time you're doing Mary Catherine Gallagher and you are mid-air. Oh Sandler's my in the frame. Oh my God. And you are, I, I don't, I'm like, how is she gonna land? <laughs> There's no That's strings. A... You are in mid-flight. Oh my god. And that god. kind of freedom. Yeah. How do you have that kind of freedom? And then also, you know, intimacy and, and struggle. Like, yeah. how does that work? Well, I think it gave me the performance. That character is just kind of an exaggerated version of how I felt when I was little, like kind of anxious and accident prone and like passionate. And I just amplified it by like a thousand. And I would get very nervous performing live on SNL, me, Molly Shannon, but I would use the nervous energy in the performance. Like when they, Jenna Rosatano was counting me down, you know, before I went on to do the first Mary Catherine, she's like, okay, we're ready. And five, four, three, two, I, I, my heart is pounding, you know, it's like an adrenaline rush. It's, I'm definitely scared, but I just like go through it. And um, I think the physical release felt really good. And um, it just, I just like get in the moment, like in the zone. You really did kill it on SNL. And you, you made these famous characters that we still quote every day of our lives. Oh, I mean, it's, it's really thank crazy. You. Thank you so much. And I think that is a fun way in which we get to like love something and the person. I mean, I do the, you know, <laughs> Sally O'Malley. I'm actually going to be 50, not so far away, you know, and everything is Mary Catherine Gallagher.